Happy holidays, hookaholics. Uh, another episode of Foul Mouth Fishing. This is actually a week overdue. Um, I had this sitting around for about a week. I haven't opened it yet, uh, but I wanted to bring it to you because of, uh, well, where this little guy came from. Uh, that package kind of put me in a bit of a tizzy. All that said, I just hadn't had time to get in front of the camera and do the reveal, but we're going to break in to our December 2021 MTV Elite. So this is your mail order elite, not your uh, retail red, although it's hard to say nowadays because they both come in the same red boxing. Uh, that all said, let's see what we got for Christmas this year, thanks to good old Santa Shop Carl. see what we got in our MTV for December Christmas of uh, 2021. Now I put up on on the communities tab for the channel uh, the option as this might have been something I would have given away uh, for Christmas this year. Uh, that being said, y'all decided that you didn't want me to give anything away, which is very, you know, respectable. Um, I still like giving, <laughs> don't get me wrong, but I want this to be a community effort, so your input is as valuable to me as anything. So uh, I appreciate all your, your input, I appreciate your voting. Uh, I'm going to keep doing little things on, on the communities tab as often as I have chance. Um, and I do read them, I do pay attention, I do like to, uh, to correspond with all of you, and that's just one more way that I can interact with you. So uh, I appreciate it for all of you, and uh, let's see what we got, what you could have got. What you might still get uh, from MTV this year. So, again, standard boiler-based, um, you know, boilerplate MTV boxing. We've got our Dibbles Digest. It's a booklet today, not a pamphlet. We got 50% off Excite Baits offer. Use MTB50 at ExciteBeats.com. So there you go, MTB50. At excitebaits.com. Uh, I don't know when it ends. Of course, they always say that. It's like at the end of a commercial. You've got three minutes to, to, to call in for $9.99 plus shipping and handling, or else it's going to disappear. But then you think about time zones and the fact that that commercial runs. It's all a gimmick to get you to open up that wallet super fast instead of thinking about it before impulse buying. <laughs> so, uh, Mystery Tackle Box, the number one fishing subscription box, now available at your local retailers. Well, don't we know? You got that Guggen Squads Mondo Box, uh, you know, the branding. You got the MTV Elite Retail Red. You got their Pro and their General. Um, so, yeah. I, I love them. And a good thing about the retails is typically if you get a box that you like, keep going back to that number to replenish or get multiple colors, you know, colorways of the uh, of that bait. So that's pretty cool. We got a little uh, maze on the back of the, uh, the Dibble Digest this month. We've got, ooh, good quantity. Two, four, six, eight, nine baits. My lucky number again. Nine items in our MTB. As always, I will do the, uh, the timestamps down in the uh, expanded um, description. So uh, if there's anything in here... You, you'll see the brand name and the, and the title of it, and then you can just click on that, and that timestamp will direct you to my expose on that particular item. And if I have any input or interesting information about it, I hope to uh, share that with you. If I don't know Jack Squat, I'll just move on to the next bait. I'm not going to waste your time. With all that said, let's start number one, the Live Targets Sunfish Hollow Body. Okay, I know these. All right, so this is your... Hollow body frog done in a bluegill sunfish pattern uh, or, or shape. Um, this one is the Crap de Soleil, <laughs> crappy color. Um, so it's bronze pumpkin seed is the color or bronze Crap de Soleil. Um, it's a four inch, three quarter ounce 
soft plastic, just like a frog. It's got the two frog hooks, and you'll you'll swim it like a dead, dying, floating bait fish. So it'll swim this way. Retrieve it just like you would a frog. Pops, twitches over lily pads. It's still good even in open water. Um, I don't think these walk very well. <laughs> just saying, they're not your typical frog. That paddle, that the tail on the end. The way it's designed, I just it doesn't really walk the same way as a frog would. And, of course, you don't really want to walk a bait fish. You want to walk a frog. Um, that being said, beautiful, beautiful design. Uh, it's a 2015 iCast uh, award winner uh, for a new product of the year. Um, but, you know, a lot of people have their, their, their goods and bads with this. Um, I don't know. I, I'm... I'm open to interpretation as to how good this is. I haven't had great success with them, that all said. Uh, they priced that at $12.99. Next up, Guggen's Squad's Junior Scout. So it's the Guggen's Squad Scout, but this is their junior size, size. So they went down and made smaller versions of this. This is a three to five foot diving, three and a half inch, three eighths ounce. Uh, the color on this is Sexy Shad. So it's basically just, you know, your standard little Guggen jerk Jerk bait, uh, subsurface three to five foot. Great bait, shads always catch. Um, again, if you have the the actual scout, the, the uh, Guggen Squad scout, this is just a slightly smaller version of it. It's a downsizer, so if fish aren't biting the big ones, and you got to match the hatch, you're getting smaller bait fish. Downsize is the way to go. They do that at eight dollars and ninety nine cents. Next up from Castaic. The CXV lipless crankbait for $7.99. The stack, you know, they have a pretty bland packaging. So this is a lipless crank, right up there with the rattle traps. Not a very loud, tiny little BBs, probably plastic BBs in there rather than the, the metal ones. Very shimmering chrome color. This is half an ounce. It's a sinking, and it's... 65 millimeters in length. Uh, I'm not going to do the math on that. <laughs> uh, but uh, half an ounce, not bad for a lipless crank. I like it for, for $6, or excuse me, $7.99, 8 bucks. It's good. Lipless cranks, great this time of year, cold water. Um, it's just been unseasonably mild for, for, you know, for winter. We had a 60, 70 degree day the other day, and it's December. It's crazy. Um, that all said, next up for $6.99, Carl's Amazing Baits, the Runt, definitely going into the giveaway because I have this bait already. So we got the Runt, which is an absolutely awesome, awesome bait. It's, it's a hybrid between a topwater, um, uh, a wake bait, and, and a small, you know, little diving lip bait. It's, it's really a great it's a surprisingly effective bait. Let's put it that way from Carl's. Um, this one comes in that, what do they call it? Chartreuse gill color. They call it the Runt Z. Runt. Uh, Carl's baits, great, great baits. I mean, they go to great manufacturers and great uh, designers and production staff. Um, it, they, this is what I thought Monster Bass should have done. You, you put out your baits in your boxes, then they gain traction. Then you put them out in retail stores. So you can go to the Dicks and the Walmarts and pick these things up. Um, so, you know, that's the way you're supposed to do it. Build your brand if you want to build it in these boxes. And then ship it out to retail stores. And then people can get them when they don't subscribe. They can go and get it at their store to replenish something they may have lost on a pinch. And, of course, you can mail order it from Shop Carl's if you've lost it and you have time. You're not, like, in a tournament. You need a replacement really fast. Um, so... Kudos to them for $6.99. Next up, $5.99. We keep doing this like dollar down. $8.99, $7.99, $6.99, from Biwa. This is the Warax. Biwa, the Warax. Now, these are great little crawl patterns. It's a JDM style product. It's a French design, by the way. JDM style, French design. These are really stinky awesome <laughs> four inch six pack of the war x cross these things are awesome awesome punch baits awesome for punching flipping pitching uh, they got a flat bottom so they even skip pretty well uh, if you 
cut off about the top head here, put it on a smaller flat jig head, or, um, or yeah, jig, and you can skip this like nothing. They're really, really effective. I do like this brand. I have a few items from them, quite frankly. I've been happily, happily impressed. Um, so there you go. Four inch, six pack, non-toxic plastic. I, I should point that out. So this is one of those that is not going to harm the fish over time. Many times I've seen fish come out with a Senko, Gary Yamamoto, Z-Mans, and they're trying to pass them, and it kind of pains me. I do use Z-Man. It's hypocritical to say, but it's the truth. And uh, I do it because of the cost effectiveness. They're a little more expensive on the outgo, on the in onset, but on the outgo, you, you get more fish on them. Um, but I'm very mindful. I try. I'm religious at checking my line to make sure that it's not frayed. I'll retie because I don't like seeing those particular plastics that are not very biodegradable. They are extremely long-lasting. get caught up by a fish, swallowed, and then it ruins the fish's digestive tract. Um, you know, they're not meant to eat these plastics. They're meant to eat the real thing. These are just emulades of those real things. So try to be, um, try to police your rounds, as they say, when it comes to your fishing lures. Uh, $5.99 for the six pack, definitely worth it. I love these things. Uh, next up, Lighthouse Lures, a company I'm not very um, familiar with. Mini Shad for $5.99. So we got a little froggy tail. I'm going to call it frog tail. We got a little soft plastic fluke jerk bait. Comes in a plastic clamshell. But I'm going to call it a froggy tail because the tail looks like a frog's foot. That's an epic little design. It's got the little finger in there. Kind of looks sort of like a frog's foot. Beautiful stained water copper color with gold and I think black flake. Yep, gold and black flake. No scent to speak of. Six-piece root beer color, they call it. Very, very apropos. Root beer, you get a six-pack. Great little eyes in it, too. Narrow design. Very awesome. 7.3 grams. It's a 110 millimeter length. Um, I'm liking these. I'm not a big soft plastic fluke jerk bait kind of person. I'd rather use a hard plastic jerk bait or, you know, a rattle trap or something like that. But uh, these, these are definitely going to find their way into my arsenal of, uh, of fishing this, this, this year. Definitely. Small, compact size, very realistic eyes, and I'm very interested to see what that, that spade toe, it's, it's concave on the back half, like, like my palm here. The, the one finger's there, and it's actually like chamfered on the on that toe so it's actually you know scalloped down that's pretty pretty darn awesome i like that five dollars and 99 cents for these lighthouse lures that's i'm gonna say lighthouselures.com vancouver british columbia canada something i should look up appreciate that something new i'm not aware of mystery tackle box gives me a, a little bit of uh, insight into a manufacturer i haven't heard of so that's pretty cool Grande, Grande Fishing. This is their Airtail Shads. This, I do know this company. Oh, I hate this color. <laughs> Love the color, hate the color. So this is made in Texas from Grande. Obviously, the name will give you the hint. These, are, again, are soft plastic flukes. These guys have a hook slot in the belly, a little cove, a depression, I should say, on the back. It's hard to pick up on camera because of the color. But what's great is they've got the ringworm kind of bobble tail rather than, you know, a fluke fin tail. Um, soft plastic, obviously this is white and, uh, and black pepper flake. Uh, design innovations made in Texas. Uh, they don't list the color. Well, they don't list the color. They call it shad spawn, I guess. Uh, it's the airtail shad. Shad spawn, I guess, is their color they're giving it. Um, not bad. The plastic on this is pretty darn stiff. It's a really rigid plastic. Grande, they're soft plastics. I don't suggest working cold water. It's more of a warm water bait because they do get stiff, uh, just to let you know. There's that. So the Grandes, again, uh, $4.99 for that. Oh, and it is a eight pack, eight pack. So 
$4.99. Not bad. Another $4.99 from Lifted. Lifted Jigs. We got ourselves another jig. I love this color, too. It's 3 8 ounce and Sun Crawl. I have this jig already. Never bad to have more than one because you know you're going to lose them. So there's a Lifted Jig. Again, this isn't particularly the jig I would go to throw uh, the the uh, these uh, Biwas. Uh, I mean, it, it, it pairs beautifully, colorway. It pairs beautifully, the green and the green. Uh, but I would go for more of a, a, a jig that I can skip uh, a lot better with this. But this is certainly their thought uh, to use to have your heart, your uh, terminal tackle, and your soft plastic together. And that, again, that was uh, $4.99. And finally, for $1.50, again, speaking to the same effect, terminal tackle. We've got a three-pack of Eagle Claw Laser Sharp Wide Gap Worm Hooks. Worm Hooks, nevertheless... I guess they're going for that with these flukes because uh, they are a EWG style for a 4 aught which should pair, yes, very nicely with these 5-inch air tails. So, uh, so you got your soft plastic and terminal tackle, $1.50 for, for the terminal tackle. Um, you've got your soft plastic jig terminal tackle. There you go. You've got yourself a little bit of fluke action that's a little different you can probably put this on those uh, four aught hooks as well you've got a top water not exactly perfect for this time of year you've got yourself your subservice jerk bait and the Guggen squads junior scout you've got yourself your rattle trap lipless crank and your lipped crank bait your subsurface crank bait in the uh, in the runt, more to me, it's a zero to three footer. I, I use this more like a wakeish bait, a subsurface wake bait. Um, turn and burn it. I gotta say, you know, aside from my own personal feelings about the sunfish, I don't really use them. Um, like I said, they're not they haven't been very very kind to me. I appreciate this box. I think this was great. I loved a, a new company that I'm not aware of getting in touch with that. So that lighthouse lures definitely intrigues me. Um, I'm very uh, wise to, to uh, Biwa and uh, Eagle Claw. Everybody knows that. It's not exactly the most expensive hook manufacturer in the world, but they are great hooks nevertheless, tried and true. And be aware uh, with things as they are in 2021, going into 2022, you're still going to see a lot of lag and supply issues, hooks being one of them. Uh, be aware that you might see... Uh, uh, hard pressed to get hooks from major manufacturers so uh if you have terminal tackle or you have the means to get terminal tackle my own personal suggestion stock up on it now before the spring uh make sure you have your plentiful with your hooks if uh, especially if you're a tournament angler or you do have a great passion for it make sure you have the hooks that you personally like or subscribe to one of these companies because they'll keep on shipping out here and there packages of hooks and terminal tackle for you when you might not be able to locate them in your local uh, stores and retailers. Uh, from me to all of you, have a happy, healthy, and wonderful Christmas, and I hope all of you enjoy and, uh, and, and have a safe new year coming up. Uh, until I catch you next cast, <laughs> peace. Hook up.